Hi everyone, it's Phil here from Ashland Leather and today I wanted to show you a bunch of special made to order wallets. But before we get to something like this uh, brand new Capone Fox, I wanted to show you a Chrome Excel belt. Our Horween leather belt is back in stock. I'm gonna show you how we package it because everything comes in a really nice cloth bag here with our hang tag. And on the inside, of course, we have our natural Chrome Excel belt. We've been waiting a while for these to come back in stock. We have some of these belts in just about every size from 30 inch to 40 and if you need a custom Custom size, maybe a, a little bit larger than that, definitely let us know. This particular belt here is 36 inches. We're shipping this out today. So if you had a made to order belt in natural Chrome Excel, this is probably yours right here. Okay, let's have a look at some made to order wallets that we are shipping out today. So sometimes people like a design like this Capone Fox here, but they want a different color combination that is not available. In fact, this Capone Fox is only made to order right now. Let me give you a little history on the Capone Fox. This is our first prototype here. This is what we're calling the Capone Fox currently in marbled black shell cordovan. This was the design that Skip Horween really wanted to see. The big difference here from our normal Capone money clip, which is this guy, is it's a little bit wider. Let's take a look at the difference. The Capone Fox is a little bit longer. The other big difference is that the Capone Fox has a bill slot inside instead of a money clip. The other interesting thing about the bill slot on this design is it goes much farther down on the right side. So it's a little bit easier to get cash inside and out of. And back to this Capone Fox here, we've got some reverse natural shell on top of some Western Amaretto shell in the center. And then the inside, we have some really nice marbled blue shell cordovan, again on top of Western Amaretto shell. Here's another nice looking Capone Fox, brown nut Dublin this time with incredible grain character. So every part of this particular wallet is made in that really great brown nut Dublin. And here's a look at the inside of the bill slot on this guy. And one more Capone Fox to look at, also with brown nut Dublin on the outside quick access card slots. We have these card slots sitting on top of some stone horsehide latigo in the center. And we have the same combination on the inside center. This particular one has been hand stitched with a cream color thread. And let's move into our regular Capone money clips. We've got reverse black shell cordovan on top of black shell cordovan for the outside of this wallet. We also have a really nice contrasting stitching going all along the outside border as well as on the inside where we have some more black shell cordovan. To me, the black shell cordovan is a very underrated color of shell cordovan. I think it's because most people find this color to be very common, but when the black shell is done right, it is really right. It's such a great bright shiny luster on this shell cordovan. Another Capone money clip here, natural shell cordovan. Got a little bit of that epic texture on the outside of this guy with a nice complementing cream color stitching on the outside as well as on the inside where we have one pattern piece with the Horween Shell Cordovan ink stamp and that's on the reverse side of the natural shell. On the left side we have another piece of reverse natural shell. Another Capone with some reverse shell Cordovan. This is reverse color eight all reverse color rate on this one. There was a request made for the ink stamp to be placed on the outside right card holder, like you see here. We've got a nice little drip mark on the outside left. Here's a look at the inside where the centerpiece, this is color number eight shell cordovan, the shell side, and on the left and right card holders, we've got reverse color eight shell cordovan. I have one Johnny the Fox today to show you, also in reverse shell cordovan. This is all reverse black shell cordovan. We're not keeping this one as a stock item any longer, but on the outside of this one, we got some really incredible die marks as well as that shell cordovan ink stamp. Here's a look at the inside where we have more reverse black shell cordovan. And I know it's totally confusing to call this reverse black, but the back side of this leather, if we look inside the wallet, it's all black shell here. So if you flip that black shell cordovan backwards, the reverse side of the black shell is that really nice green color. It does range in color a significant amount. Sometimes it's a little bit darker and more forest green. Sometimes it's a little bit lighter. And even sometimes you see a little bit of blue on this reverse black shell cordovan. All right, let's have a look at some Bugs Morans and vertical Bugs Morans. The first one we're gonna look at here, really cool piece of skip finish shell cordovan. This is kind of like marbled meets inverted. Anyways, it's a new version of finishing trials that Skip Horian has been working on. I'm not certain what to call it yet other than the skip finish. And I don't think we have much of this left. So a few people have picked up made to order wallets in this really special leather. And we've also made some private stock wallets on the skip finish. But anyways, the skip finish here has a little bit of a color range from that classic cordovan color, the color eight sort of dark brown burgundy. And it ranges down to a little bit more of this orangey tan natural shade in the lighter tonal sections. On the inside of this wallet, we've got just about everything. Let me see if I can name these off. Looks like it got a little bit of marble shell on the top, violet shell in the center, epic natural shell on the bottom left. On the top right, we've got magenta shell cordovan, 
It looks like maybe color four underneath, and then this is psychedelic shell cordovan on the bottom right. Here's another Bugs Moran with a custom variant. This one has a quick access card slot on the outside, which a lot of people have been requesting. Maybe we should offer this as a standard. On the inside of this one, we've got some reverse shell cordovan on the left, but only one card slot. And on the right side, it looks like we've got some cigar shell cordovan with a Horween ink stamp in the center. And here's a really special piece. This is reverse blue shell cordovan with some epic splatter. And there were a few shells that had this great look. So we've we've actually made some private stock out of this. It seems like people really enjoy it. So we've taken some made to order wallets. This one also has a contrasting yellow hand stitching all along the outside border, which plays very well. Here's a look at the inside where we have vertical card slots on the left and right card holders. And up next here, I have another vertical card slot Bugs Moran with some incredible Western Amaretto Show Cordovan on the inside. We've got a nice little Horween ink stamp. If you're not familiar with the vertical card slots on our Bugs Moran, this is a variation on what we normally do for the Bugs Moran. We've got the card orientation going from the top. So you enter your cards through the top of the wallet like this. And then there's also hidden card slots underneath each side. Here's a look at the exterior of this one where we have some really nice natural shell cordovan. And here's a fun two-shot card case in a pretty rare shell cordovan color and finish. This is marbled cigar shell cordovan on the two shot. The two shot card case is named the two shot because there are two compartments. Both of these will fit credit cards, but it won't fit cash just perfectly. You'd have to fit cash folded into thirds in order to fit it inside either of the two slots here. And here's another Bugs Moran, but this is our traditional card slots. You can see two card slots on the left, two on the right. The larger of each will fit US dollars folded in half underneath each of those sides. This is another product that we sort of thin the herd down on our standard offerings, let's say. So we don't normally offer the natural Chrome Excel Bugs Moran anymore. They're all made to order at this point. And it's a really nice leather, really popular color, especially on footwear. We also make natural Chrome Excel belts like you saw earlier in the video. The leather that we choose to use for our unlined belts are more than twice the thickness of the leather that we use for the wallets. And it's actually a little bit more difficult for the tannery to source thicker hides to make those unlined belts. And here's a fun one too for me to see, a blast from the past. This was our second wallet design that we ever made. This is called the Louis Little New York, and it has two components Apartments on the inside, a larger section that will fit credit cards as well as US dollars folded in half. And then on the left side, we have one smaller card holder. So this folds asymmetrically. And the idea for the Louis Little New York was to be a little bit more of a minimalist style. So just a couple cards on the left, maybe a little bit of cash on the right. And the Louis folds up into a very small form factor. So the hope was that this would be a very nice front pocket wallet. The other thing about this made to order Louis Little New York is it's made in a really nice piece of denim blue shell cordovan. And I have another Louis here in my favorite shell cordovan color. This is an amaretto shell cordovan. Really nice orangey tan shade of the amaretto. And it's a very dynamic color. So depending on what angle you look at it, it's a little bit darker, a little bit lighter at certain angles, a little bit more vibrant yellow and orange at others. I have one more vertical card slot Bugs Moran to show you. Take a look at the outside of this one. This is the epic texture on the natural shell cordovan. And I say texture, it's more of a visual texture because there is no feel to it. You can see it's very, very flat and smooth. It just has this sort of streaking look in it that we call the Epic Natural. Here's a look at the inside where we have alternating card slots with natural shell cordovan and reverse natural in the centers. I have two Tony the Ants to show you, both of which are really special. This is a variation on the skip finish, and I'm not really sure what to call this one. You can see it's a little bit different than the one we looked at earlier in the video. It's just a different effect that Skip has come up with, and I'm honestly not sure what to call it, but it is very beautiful. Both variations are very nice. Here's a look at the inside of this one. We have Cigar Shell Cordovan on the right with Amaretto Shell Cordovan on the left. And here's another Tony the Ant, Black Shell Cordovan this time. We have a waxed and burnished edge. We've actually switched to all hand-stained edges for our black and color eight shell cordovan items. So this is a special request. And the other thing special that was requested on this one was to have no hot stamps. So you can see the inside is a very clean and minimalist look. And we saw the two-shot card case earlier. This is the one-shot card case with only one compartment on the inside. This is also a minimalist front pocket design. This particular one is made in that really nice denim blue shell cordovan. You can see at certain angles of the denim blue, it's a little bit more aqua blue 
and then other angles it's a little bit darker and I have a piece of intense blue that we can compare this to in a moment. All right, let's move into some Fat Herbies. This is actually the wallet design that I'm wearing right now and let me pull it out of my pocket. So the Fat Herbie I've been wearing for the last couple of weeks is a really remarkable piece of tumbled natural shell cordovan. and you can see the denim color from my jeans starting to wear off on all the corners, but I just love the texture on this specific piece of tumbled natural shell cordovan. Back to the uh, topic at hand here, we've got this violet shell cordovan fat herbie here, and this fat herbie is just made of incredible pieces of shell. I love the violet shade. It's a relatively new color offering from Horween. More of a straight up purple shade when you compare it to something like the ultraviolet, which has a little bit more magenta tones in it. Here's a look at the inside. We also have violet shell cordovan on the interior. Here's another really good piece of the epic natural shell cordovan. You can see very, very flat and smooth, but we do see some of that visual texture in the natural shell. This one is a hand-stitched wallet, which turned out beautifully. We have the cream color stitching on the outside and on the inside where we have reverse color eight shell cordovan. Here's another hand-stitched wallet. We do charge a little bit more for hand-stitching as well as all the made-to-order wallets. This is natural Chrome Excel with a blue color hand-stitch, and I really like the combination of natural and blue together. I think that looks great. Here's a look at the inside of this wallet where we have more natural Chrome Excel. And here's a piece of marbled green shell cordovan. I don't think we have any more of this leather. In fact, I think I've only seen it once or twice. There hasn't been much marbled green shell cordovan made, and we should probably get more of it because the result here is really beautiful. You can see on the marbled green, it has a little bit more of a color range from a green to an orangey tan, where on some of the marbled blue and marbled black, it has much less of this green overtone to it. The larger slot that we call the middle piece of the Fat Herbie is also made in the marbled green, but it's a little bit darker on the top there, so there is some variance in the marbled green. On the inside, we've got raw natural shell cordovan. One more Fat Herbie to look at today. This is also skip finish shell cordovan, a little bit more of that contrasty look on this specific one. A little bit more of a dark brown burgundy shade with the orangey tan natural colors underneath. Let me spin this one around because it has a really great range of color. Let me try to spin it this way instead. Really nice color range from that dark brown burgundy of the color eight to the lighter orangey tan shades underneath and even on the middle slot there too. And here's a look at the inside, which plays off the colors on the exterior very well. We've got Amaretto Shell Cordovan on the left with Cigar Shell Cordovan on the right. Great Horween ink stamp in the center. And the last piece to look at today, I mentioned Intense Blue Shell Cordovan. This is a really nice piece of Intense Blue Shell. It's, got a, it's a little bit of a fingerprint magnet on this particular one, but this is what I wanted to compare to the denim blue shell cordovan on the one shot. You'll notice on the intense blue shell cordovan, it's much darker, much more of a navy blue, depending on what angle you look at it. And it's definitely got blue to it, and it's, it does appear black in certain lighting scenarios. But if you compare it next to black, for example, uh, you can see there's definitely more blue in there. And then compared to the denim blue, much lighter on the denim blue when compared to intense blue. This is our checkbook case. And we don't make a lot of these. They're made by special request only. And we've got the same intense blue shell cordovan on the interior of this guy. Here's where you can put your checkbooks on the right side, a little bit of a larger compartment on the left side here. So thanks for checking out everything in the video today. Everybody that's picked up one of these made to order wallets, including this remarkable Fat Herbie. Thank you guys so much for supporting us. Really appreciate you guys. Until next time, I hope you have a good one.